Now if you watched the last video you'll have seen that we took the gearbox part following from the trip to Yorkshire which we didn't get there. Um, the gearbox came apart, we diagnosed the issue um, and all the bits have arrived. The engine came out not long after and that's been sat around in the garage ever since. And to bring you up to speed with, with what's happened between now and then, um, the engine's been dropped back in, radiators back on, fuel tanks back in. So I've done the brake lines, just uh, neaten them up a bit. A bit of painting's been done on the chassis, bit of work there. Um, also the flywheel clutch put back on, ready for the gearbox to be rebuilt. Also on the driver's side of the engine, a different engine mount was used since Previously, um, it had a bunch of spaces underneath and it didn't quite sit level, so this time there's a different engine mount that's been drilled slightly differently, meaning that the engine can sit just a bit more level, whether you can see it or not. Um, it wasn't too much off in the first place, but I think just make it sit nicer um, is worth doing and not too much hassle, really. Since I last picked up the camera, quite a lot's happened really. Yesterday, my granddad was over, we were getting the um, getting the gearbox rebuilt. Uh, most of it was done, kind of all the knowledge came from him, all the work came from my dad, and well, I just stood around and filmed stuff really. Today, we've had the gearbox being dropped in. We're trying to rise, just trying to get Mac to marry up with the engine, but that's dropped in all right. And now, the plan is for tomorrow for the exhaust to get put on, the clutch and a couple of other things to get connected up so that we could just get it fired up and just cycle it through the gears without the prop shaft on. Just to spin it over and see if everything's as it should be before everything gets put back together and then the plan is for everything to be put back on. Um, I'd probably start off pedals and stuff through, uh, floor on, seat box, and then work away up really. Once once it's running and um, we know it goes through the gears fine, then start building it up and hopefully it won't be too long till, till we're back on the road for a bit of a test drive. good get some footage a few photos um, it's all running nicely a few things to kind of check up on but that's to be expected so ready for the summer we're going to Ballar in June uh, some other trip planned here and there some events hope you enjoy something different putting the gearbox back together hopefully some more some more kind of the usual of getting out and about in the summer